Hello, this is William Barron from Dark Effects TV here to bring you another exciting tutorial. And this one right here is how to troubleshoot an ASP Classic. And uh, the error that I'm going to present to you today is a common error, especially whenever you're doing uh, uh, sending out emails or doing response out rights and so forth. But whenever you're sending out emails, you create uh, your email processing form. So it looks like this right here. And so every once in a while you might uh, forget to add in your double quotes at the end of your line or uh, you may separate a line but not meaning to, which would give you the error that we will have right here. As you can see, we've got a very long error. Scroll all the way across, we know that it's on line 90. And it is at the end of our horizontal rule styling, which is right here. So what we need to do is that we need to go into our mail form and look at line 90. Now this is our mail form right here. Now line 90 begins and ends right there. But as you can see, we got double quotes there, but we do not have a double quote there. Now looking at line 91, we do not have the HTML body tag added in to the beginning of the line. <clears throat> so that will make it to where that's not supposed to be the beginning and this is not supposed to be the end. Now, you can make this the end and this the beginning by simply adding in a double quote there and then copying out your mail tag here and pasting it there. But that's not what this error uh, was. What this error was was that uh, I had added in this image um, information right here and whenever I added in the image code I forgot to backspace up so let's go back so right here the only thing that I need to do to clear up this error is to backspace up and as you can see our line 90 begins here and ends right there so it's got its beginning HTML body tag and its ending double quotes so then we save that and we go back inside of our page here and then we click on send query and we should get an error letting us know that okay well that it was sent and that somebody will respond in a timely manner so uh, once again if you receive that error just make sure that it is um, a little sluggish here show it to you one more quick time and let's submit it and the error is 800A0409 I will also have a link in the description uh, to our knowledge base that also has information regarding this error as well <clears throat> so once again I hope that you enjoyed this quick tutorial and always remember to double check your code and on simple errors, it is just as simple as hitting your backspace button, saving, and then going back into your form and sending your query. And then everything should run like it's supposed to. So once again, this is Wayne Barron from Dark Effects TV. I hope that you enjoyed this very quick ASP troubleshooting tutorial. And do not forget to subscribe. And y'all have a rocking week into the weekend. Thank you.